Greetings, it's Maxo Diddley, and today I'm going to be showing you how you can upload your existing Game Maker Studio 2 or Game Maker Studio project to GitHub. Let's get right into it. So firstly, make sure you have GitHub Desktop downloaded and installed. There'll be a link in the description below for you to do so. And once you've got all that set up, you want to go to File and then go to Options. And you want to then make sure you are signed into a GitHub account. Once you have, you can close this window. Then you want to go up to File and then go to Add Local Repository. Then you want to click on the Choose button. Now you need to navigate to where your Game Maker Studio 2 or Game Maker Studio project is. Once you've found the folder for your project, double click on it to open it up and Basically, you want to select the folder that contains all of these other folders like data files, options, rooms, script shaders, and sprites. And you want to then click on select folder. Once you do that, it will then say, this directory does not appear to be a Git repository. Would you like to create a repository here instead? The blue text that says create a repository, click on that. Then you want to give your repo a name. I'll stick to what it recommends and call it Epic Space Game. You can add a description if you want to. I'll type Blair. Local path, keep that the same. You can initialize it with a readme if you want to, which is going to be a little document that you can customize to tell people what your project's about. For Git Ignore, you do not need one for a Game Maker Studio 2 project or for Game Maker Studio. And for license, you can keep it the same if you want to. Then click on Create Repository. So now we've got a local repository for our Game Maker Studio 2 project. Then you want to click on Publish Repository up here. And for the repo name, keep it the same. Description, keep that the same. If you want, only you and anyone you invite to your repo to be able to view the code. You want to keep this, keep this code private tick box ticked. But if you want anyone to be able to view this code and make changes, you can untick this. But I'll keep it ticked. Organization, you can add one if you want, but I'm not going to. Then we click on Publish Repository. This could take a while, depends on how big your project is. But with all that, it's now on GitHub. So what you can do is you can go to your GitHub repositories and notice this. We have now got a new private repo called Epic Space Game with the description that we gave it before of Blair and it was updated just now. So thanks for being a great audience. Be sure to leave a like in the comments if you enjoyed and subscribe for more tutorials. Thanks for watching.